I, uh, I love my dad. We, we got along great before the murder. I was happy at home. And what changed? Annie. She moved in and took over. Totally controlled my father overnight. It was like she belonged and I didn't. Didn't you discover that your father had been hiding your mother's letters from you for years? Isn't that why you moved out? <clears throat> uh, yes. And we... isn't it true that you just moved back in? Uh, yes. So, I'm clearly not that horrible to live with. Objection. So you lied. I didn't. That's called perjury. Objection. Uh, move along, Mrs. Chandler. <sighs> Even though I did all of those things to protect your father, you're just joining the mob. Objection. Spreading the hate. No. The fact is, I didn't drive you from your home, did I? No. No more questions. It was the hardest thing I ever did. Moving out of my father's house. My house. But I didn't have a choice. And do you think the defendant protected your father by not telling the truth? Any lavery. It's Chandler. Kidnapped. Killed. And used people. Uh, objection. Sit down, Mrs. Chandler. What will you do if Mrs. Chandler does go to prison? Well, that's between my father and me. Right. Mrs. Chandler, your witness. No questions. The prosecution rests. That's your cue, defense. Call your witness. I'd, I'd like a recess, if that's okay. Why not? Ten minutes. You're gonna have to stop running away, sweetheart. I'm so worried about you. I didn't tell anyone. I swear. Let's get you out of here. I saw the Hubbards. They're very concerned about you. I, I explained to them that you, you're not well. Randy uh, understood. <laughs> Boy, you have caused quite a ruckus. Now let's get you home and forget about all this. I don't want to go home. Oh, that is just too damn bad. Because you have embarrassed me for the last time. Hey, get the hell away from her. Jesse, you have to do something. You have to help. Madison's at the pine cone. I told her father, and he went there, and then I saw Frankie and brought, and I told you them. You they what? Were... What happened? I'm sorry. You know, I just, I believe Mr. Beardsley. He seemed really worried. All right, sweetheart, look, it's, it's all right. I mean, you didn't know. Oh, what room is she in? 16. Oh. Erica? No, I've got it. You call it in. I'm so sorry. You know, I want Madison out of our lives, but I just really believed her father. Well, you're not the only one. It just looks like we were wrong. Hey, you were really gonna understand there, man. Yeah. Got a feeling that anything I do or say at this point makes no difference. We don't know that. I can hang around to find out. <sighs> you know, I can't say that I'm sorry that Annie's defending herself. <laughs> it's going better than I thought. <laughs> Annie just took a recess so she can talk to Adam. Yeah, well, she's in trouble for only witnesses going to bury her. If. He buries her. Adam knows what's at stake. He'll send her to the wolves. Do you love me? <laughs> of course I love you. You know that. Are you sure? 
You put me on the stand and I will prove to you how much I love you. Hand on a Bible. You have been loving, have you not? And uh, faithful? It's uh, up to me to repay you in kind.